It's Harden at the podium. Lucia Pinichos from Argentina and Evian Linea. To both of you, Steve Kerr said he couldn't make it in the NBA today because both teams are absolutely amazing. What do you think about that? And how do you see yourself playing in the 90s? Hmm? Yeah. In the 90s? I was born in 85. I don't know. <laughs> you were born in the 90s. Chill out. I was born in 89. Really? Close. I can't answer that question. Sorry. Sports Radio 610. Uh, James Thompson. Can I ask a fashion question? Will you talk about Durant? Say what? <laughs> if I ask a fashion question, will you talk about Durant? Well, you got you ask a question, but not give an answer. Uh, what's your favorite shoe brand? Shoe brand. Jordan, obviously. <laughs> uh, any explanation on uh, th those, those they, games against them? They, they played better. You don't think they're better than your team, though, right? Sure they are. They just beat the hell out of us twice. Does that mean we're better? That's a silly question. How, how, how smart would I look if I said, no, we're better than they are? Is that what you were hoping I would say? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, Russ, you've had um, multiple pe mul multiple players come out. Um, I'm sorry. Well, I'm so nervous. Let me come back. We've all been there, dudes, right? Hey, Russ. Um, you, you had a guy like Carmelo Anthony. <laughs> About five games, five blowouts to us who don't really know the, the game. How do you explain that? You're serious. You really think I can explain that? <laughs> In simplest terms. <laughs> I know you can. The question is, will you? Good Lord. Yeah. And they pay you, don't they? They pay Very you. little. <laughs> <laughs> Thus the question. <laughs> That's why I'm not much. up there. It's <laughs> like not wearing their jersey when they're coming out to play. How frustrating is it for you to keep composure in that in that moment? How hard is You're it? You're serious. I'm. Anybody else got a question? <laughs> Makes any sense? Is it? Does that not bother you? Anybody? Are not you? a lick. Why would it bother me? It doesn't bother you that someone's not wearing their jersey when they're on the court? You talk about learning defense, progressing in that capacity. Um, how has he come along? Um, fired your um, uniform coordinator at the office now? No, I don't know why you guys even care about that. It's, it's silly. You can ask me about the color of somebody's shoelaces next or something if they don't tie their shoes. Champ, you put the uh, boys from Tinseltown really through the heebie-jeebies Wednesday night. How did it feel to play the one and really be on the trolley back in your hometown? Um, it was good. You know, just, um, you know, a lot of guys out there. First first game as, you know, with, with some new faces on our team. So uh, for us, it was just, you know, trying to come away with the win. Uh, it didn't happen, but um, we got another opportunity today. You and Clint working well together. Is this going to be a good one? I'd like to leave on a happy note here <laughs> after getting my butt kicked. Is it? Go ahead. Um, circumstances always different every game, every series. Kawhi's well, that's good. Injury, I agree with that. Injury, Kawhi, Kawhi's injury being kind of foremost among uh -huh. that. But for the Warriors to start 12-0. and 0 Is this going to be a long question? Because if I it think is. It, I think it already is, but it's not going to be much longer. 12-0 12 and 0 in the playoffs, how impressive is that to you? Really impressive. Not really, really. Anybody else have a question that makes sense? And I'll be happy to answer it. What kind of wine are you going to have tonight? <laughs> I'm just trying. You some cute hat in the block. Um, what do you want me to say? <laughs> Whatever you want to say. It's just more of just the build up leading into that play, what you were seeing and your thought process with everything. Um, Patrick threw me the ball. I took two dribbles to the paint and tried to jump high and dunk the basketball. <laughs> and Kimba got it 
open for a three and I jumped to my highest to try to contest and I got a block. What do you think of the perception from some media members of Tony Allen's in your head? Is that just an overreaction to one game? What's your take on that guy? <laughs> they know what I think now. That's all I gotta say. Right. <laughs> in my head, come on, man. Yeah, Kevin, uh, you had. Um... Oh, sorry, I forgot my question. I won't waste your time. It happens. Damn. <laughs> hey, I feel you, though. It's all good. <laughs> I forgot, a I forgot a couple plays in that. Uh, g'day from Australian TV. There's a lot of excitement at home because of the, uh, the Australian involvement in this game. What different d difference do we bring to the, to the game, do you think, as, as players? And also, lots being said about Delhi being dirty. Are, are we tough players? Is that what we're all about? Can you play ball? <laughs> Not on your nelly. Oh, no. man. I was going to ask coach to pick you up. We need another Australian on our team. Uh, uh, I, love our, I love our Australian that we have. I love Delhi. What he brings to our team is just brings toughness and grit determination and just try to beat all the odds um you know he's been great for us um and um, i know he he's happy to be back here too just been playing college ball here you know and um i know he's excited being back and uh, you know it should be very fun but uh yeah i love you australian guys you guys are cool why did you kind of tone that down knowing that there's this extra attention on you tone what down the the kicks uh you think I'm trying try to kick Curry? No, no, no. No, the question that I'm asking you are: Are you aware of it? There seems to be extra scrutiny on it. Is there something that you could do to kind of make sure these things don't don't come up to people, or even would have that question to ask you? No, nah, if I was aware of something, I wouldn't do it. Um, but basketball is basketball, and you know bodies react a certain type of way, and you know, I don't really mind any scrutiny it doesn't bother me um i'm gonna still live my life and do everything i do the same way and not lose any sleep so life goes on started uh, danny green uh, basically on kevin did that work very well I... did you watch the game yes what do you think <laughs> didn't it didn't work very well so we'll we'll have danny grow four or five inches by Monday night, uh, tell him to jump higher and move quicker. And we'll tell Kevin, don't be so good. Uh, what do you mean, Rabbit? What do you think, Rabbit? Not sure. I don't know. I couldn't see don't from lie. what I said. Don't lie. You couldn't see. You saw the replay four times. What, what happened? He fell on your leg. Thank you. Don't ask me a dumb question you don't answer to. You think it was intentional? Did you see it? I saw it a couple like? times. What it like? Anybody touch him? I didn't yes see no? it. I didn't see the replay yet. Oh, you didn't see it? But no. Why you asking about something? You just ask, I just saw the play live. Well, if you didn't see it, don't ask me a question. Don't ask me dumb questions. Obviously, it was intentional. So ask me, was it intentional? Nobody touched me, fell over my leg, tried to hurt me, you know. But hey, that's how I go. You think that's something the NBA needs to look into? Hey, man, they see it and, and look at it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Really, all they've done is hold home court. So when you go down, what's your urgency? Game three, or is there any urgency? We probably should try hard to win that game. That would, <laughs> that would be the urgency. Jeez, oh whiz, guys, come on. Think of a question. From being in this position against the Hornets two years ago. What? You were in this think about the Hornets two years ago? You were in similar position. Lost no, I won't think before. about that at all. These guys are grown men. They don't need me to say. Now, remember the Hornets, fellas. we got to really pull it together for game three. Maybe I'll talk about the Gipper if I'm going to talk about the Hornets. I mean, you know, they're grown. They know what they have to do. They know they're down 2-0, and they'll come back and try their best again in game three, and we'll win or we'll lose. Damari Carroll said that a player should never dive at another player's feet. Okay to dive for a basketball, but never to dive at another player's feet. In the case of Corver in game two, in the case of Horford tonight, did you feel that you were guilty of doing any such thing? Um, I got, I got it. I can answer if you want. No, no, you got it. I, I saw the ball. I dived on the floor. If I stay on my belly, it's going to be a jump ball. So I protect the ball and kick it out to a teammate. On the other one, I'm boxing him out. He's pulling my left arm down. I'm, I'm trying to stay up, and he's just pulling me down. So. I mean, the, the tape's there. 20 points, 14 rebounds, 
three steals, three blocks, three assists. Kawhi Leonard, who are you, man? Kawhi Leonard.